three, two, one. What's up guys, it's Bryson here, and today we are here with the first thing of the series, which is story time with Bryson. Now, this is going to be a series about all the stupid crap I've done in my life, which has led to me getting hurt or something stupid. The first story is coming from a couple of years ago in 8th grade. Now, this was towards the end of the year, probably May, June, somewhere around there. Um, and we were in gym. 8th grade gym. And we were playing football. I remember this perfectly. We were playing football. And I was against my best friend. His name is Josh. Now, Josh and I were very competitive in gym because we were both fast. And I thought this was good that we'd play against each other because we wouldn't destroy the other team. So, we did that. We were doing good and I was playing running back. Now, he was playing safety. So, I ran past everybody. Everybody. And I hurt some kid. I don't remember what I did. I think I knocked him into him and knocked him over. And I tripped. Now, me tripping, I got my balance back up and uh, all this good crap -oda. And Josh was down there and I was running full force. And he hooked his arm into mine now this this hurt because I kept running and it pulled my arm back and popped my shoulder out of socket how it popped out that easy I don't know but what I didn't know is that this shoulder popping out led to me tearing my rotator cuff which if you don't know is like the muscles around the uh, the shoulder I can't really describe it, but if I can, I'll get a picture up and I'll show you guys. Um, so because of that, my rotator cuff tore and my shoulder dislocated. Now me being the stupid, I think I was like 12 or 13 at the time, me being stupid, I'm like, you know, I can put my own shoulder back in. And, and I did, and it didn't go in right. Let's just put it at that. It did not go in right, and it made it worse. So we went to the nurse at our school, and she put my shoulder back. No, she pulled my shoulder out because she had, she had to dislocate my shoulder again. She could put it in right, and that didn't work very well. And this all led to me having to go to the hospital. They didn't... They... This is where it kind of gets a little fuzzy, but I'm not sure what happened from there. All I know is that the next day I got a, I woke up, I didn't wake up. I had to get a sling and I went into school and everyone made fun of me because I pretty much tore my own rotator cuff. Um, so yeah, I'm stupid. Lesson learned from that is don't play against your friend in football and run into him so you don't tear your shoulder because it ends very badly. But there is more to this story. So he tore my rotator cuff, which that was an accident. And then um, that day at lunch that I came back, the table, our lunch table was me, him, and a couple other of our friends. Now our other friend who um, we don't really talk to anymore because he went to a different school, he... He enjoyed hitting his head on the table very hard. Like uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna demonstrate how hard he'd hit his head against the table with my hand. That's about how hard he'd hit his head, and this was funny. We died every time he did this. We would die laughing. Now we all got in trouble one day because he hit his head on the table so hard that all the teachers came and asked him if he was okay while we are laughing and I got a little too excited and um, this led to me maybe possibly again 
smashing my shoulder onto the pillar behind me. Now this did not feel very good and it hurt very bad, which led to me probably, I think this is where another part where it gets kind of fuzzy. I think I had to go back to the hospital because it hurt so bad. And I don't remember any of that, but we all got detentions. The next day, the, the teacher that saw us, she gave all of us a lunch detention and an after school detention, which sucked really bad because we laughed at our friend bashing his head against the table and we got in trouble for it now I don't know about you guys but our school at the time had this thing where it was called your stars it was like your class stars or something like that I can't really remember this was if you didn't get any detentions throughout the year you got to go on a field trip now we are uh, we're star students we've never had a detention before this and this was my detention that wouldn't let me go on the trip because I had lunch detentions before that um so we went to the office to the vice principal Mr. Simpson who was the coolest guy ever um and he repealed the detentions after we served them for being uncon un unconductly against the code of conduct pretty much that the teacher was out of their place for giving us a detention and we all thought this was hilarious so the moral of the story is don't hurt yourself because once you do it you're gonna do it again like when I did I hurt my shoulder then I also, again, hurt my shoulder at lunch and got a detention in the same two days. Stupid. But that was my first story of the series. So if you guys want to hear some more, they'll be up, I'd say, what, every Tuesday, Wednesday, around there. Um, no time, but they'll be up sometime between then. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'll get another one up Friday, hopefully, and I will see you guys next time. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, why don't you click that like button? I know you want to. I know you do. But hit that like button and hit subscribe if you want. I'm not gonna make you do anything. Leave a comment on if you thought the story was stupid or funny, because I know I'm an idiot. I hope you guys enjoyed. Adios.